Number 39. Suppose a motor connected to a 120 volt source draws 10 amps when it first starts. Letter A. What is its resistance? All right. So this is a nice blast from the past because it's simply Ohm's law. In other words, VR, voltage is equal to current multiplied by resistance. So to find the resistance, all we simply have to do is divide up the current from both sides. And then since they give it to us, we just got to plug in now the values. So the resistance here is going to be equal to 12 ohms. Easy peasy. Now for letter B, what are they asking? They're saying what current does it draw at its normal operating speed when it develops 100 volts of back EMF? So this back EMF, you can, uh, you know, you can think about it as like a, a resistive EMF, so to speak. This uh, back EMF will oppose the driving EMF, and therefore the voltage supplied, all right, is actually going to be the, we can consider it the driving voltage subtracted by the back voltage. So in other words, the voltage supplied now is actually going to be 120 minus than 100. So it's just 20 volts now, okay? Now we also will assume uh, that the resistance inside of this particular uh, motor is constant. And therefore, to find now the current, I can again apply, apply Ohm's law. Solve this now for the current, so divide out, um, well, that would just be silly, right? <laughs> so the uh, divide out now the resistance from both sides, and since we know all the values, we're gonna plug them in. So this is 20, this is 12, and let's see what we get. So it's 20 then divided by 12, and we get a value of about 1.67 or so, right, 1.67, and that's in terms of amps now. So that's the actual amount of current uh, when it's at normal operating speed. So guys, thanks so much for tuning in. Hopefully that helps. If it does, help us out. Subscribe, like, tell your friends. We'll see you in the next video. Take care.